today is to pick up from my introduction yesterday afternoon. Where the wellness industry is today, and how it's emerging as its own industry. Because wellness and nutrition has somehow been confused often with hospitals, with healthcare, with what I call the sickness industry. And what we're really seeing in wellness is the emergence of a whole new industry. Back a hundred years ago, in the United States, a man named Henry Ford invented the automobile. But it wasn't called an automobile. It was called a horseless carriage. Because people thought all he made was a carriage that had a different kind of horse. And a few people said, that's ridiculous. Who wants a horseless carriage? There were no roads to drive on. There were no gasoline stations to fill it up. People worked seven days a week. They didn't have the time to take off for a Sunday drive in the country. But a few people saw that the horseless carriage was not a modification of the carriage, but a completely new industry that would change everything about our lives. From a hotel becoming a motel, which you can drive into, from a restaurant being defined not by Chinese food, French food, American food, but being defined by the speed they serve you, called fast food, because you wanted it back in your car. And those people who saw it early saw roads, saw gasoline stations, saw people having leisure time, a whole new industry. And I'll also, as I'll explain this morning, we had a similar revolution when computers first came out. And people thought a personal computer was a fast typewriter. And they even called them word processes, to process words. They had no idea it was something so big it would change every aspect of our lives. And we're just at the beginning of the computer age in our lifetime. Wellness is no different. But I hope you'll we'll see this morning, and more important, learn from the professionals on the stage in the next few days, is that wellness is an entire new industry, like the automobile, like the personal computer, like so many more. And those industries, automobiles, quickly became in the United States the largest industry in the world. 